and vaccines are wonderful creations in this planet. A little bit of something you give to take care of it, and the whole body likes it, and, it, and the body, our human body is awesome, to put it lightly. It has so much defense mechanism. The creator, we call God, whoever, whoever God is, did a beautiful job creating this body. It has so much checks and balances. It has so much protection. It's, it's medicine is wonderful. If you, all, if you guys only understand how this body works, but well, we don't, we, we, we think we understand a lot of it, but not totally, but it's great. So that is my little story. And most of it, 95% I'm telling about, it's all in the book. It's the love of my patients, some of them that actually did so well. Some of them that didn't listen as much, did not do as well. So this book, this book has got so many facets of it. It's about us being doctors, the kind of, the, the hard problems that we go through sometimes, to get people to be compliant to do the medicine, and the problems we have with that. And then we, we also, we can adapt. We can adapt to any situations. Our training, we up the whole night, the next morning, we still gotta go to rungs, we gotta, when we're residents, you know, so many things we have to adapt to. And adaptation is, is part of us being, as, as being a physician. So, and humans also adapt very easily. So the, the thing is, is that this book is going to be for generations to come, because anytime you talk about a pandemic, you're going to go through the journey of the COVID-19. And I think I did a pretty good job explaining it. I made it pretty simple for a non-physician or a physician to understand. And I think that's the way we should do stuff, especially a very, you know, this is, a, this is such a very common virus, people need to know about it, a lot about it. So that's my little story. And what the book did was vividly portray the challenges, triumphs, and also profound human connections that were forged during the peak of the COVID-19 pandemic. It provides invaluable insights into the daily realities of medical pra practitioners, oftentimes operating or navigating through unprecedented time, from treatment strategies to navigating public skepticism around vaccines, as you know, that was prominent during that time. Now, this creative non-fictional account not only captures the clinical aspect of managing COVID-19 patients, but also it delves into the emotional and ethical dimensions of care. And what it did, it painted a moving picture of healthcare professionals on the front line their dedication and the sacrifices made to safeguard public health amidst uncertainty and fear. So, so I really like the title of the book, and I can't really more emphasize how important, um, you know, looking at the lens because the family, because you, the problem, you have a very good family medicine program, you don't need a hospital, you know. You don't need a cardiologist, you don't need an endocrine, you don't even need a general surgeon. You know, all those intervention cards, you don't even need them. And so this is the best lens to, you know, to, to, to really look and evaluate the pandemic.